Alrighty guys, are y'all ready for our very first Black Ops 3 Zombies Challenge, okay? Today, I want to do a challenge that I know wasn't, uh, that I wouldn't last too long in, and that is Spawn Room Only Challenge. And uh, the way this works is we're not allowed to take and leave our spawn area. The only two weapons we're allowed to have is this here pistol and then the Shiva, I believe is how you pronounce it over there. And we just got to take and survive as long as possible in here. So uh, let's get started. You know, my goal would be to make it to like round 10. But this here is a very, uh, it's a fun challenge. But it is rather difficult because you ain't really got that much, uh, that much movement room. It's kind of cluttered. But we'll see how it goes. Ain't really no point in trying to rack up that many points. But we'll go ahead and buy these, uh, two wall guns as soon as possible. Now beforehand, I probably should have took and worked on the Shiva a little bit more, get some attachments for it. But this thing just sucks. How much was it? Was it 250? I don't know. Might be a one hit. Yeah, it's good. It should be a one shot headshot for a while. You know, for each challenge I do, which I mean I have a lot I plan on doing, I would like to do it on like each map. But now, like I think that this challenge right here would be near impossible on uh, Shadows of Evil because that the, the layout of that starting room is just ridiculous. But then again, you can always become the beast. Or technically, you know, you could shoot the Shadow Man and get to round 15, and technically. Made round 15 to start. Whoa! What was that? Hmm. Yeah, but now, like, uh, like I said, I have a bunch of challenges I plan on doing, but if y'all have a specific challenge you would like for me to attempt, just leave it in the comments down below, and I will uh, try to get to it as soon as possible. God, two headshot, I mean, two shot headshot already. Got a dang fire restriction. Try to camp as long as possible, just shoot him from a distance, but it's only gonna work so long. But hey, round four. We're only three minutes in, or four, I guess. Yeah, I'm thinking that uh, the next challenge I'll do will be one weapon only which is as soon as you buy a wall weapon and or hit the box and accept that weapon that is the only weapon you can have for the rest of the game um, I'm trying to think um, and you can't yeah and that's and you can pack a punch it also so. that'd be pretty interesting especially if I'm getting the sucky gun I'm going to have to switch this pistol here in a minute. I mean, you know, I'm really, I'm really liking this double XP week. Okay. Might as well get that, because like I said, we ain't on no, uh, we ain't trying to point war here. Yeah, I think, I think round 10's relatively, uh, Achievable. Let's see what this thing does, with dogs. Who breeds these things? Okay, pistol. It's sad when a pistol is better than this, uh, this rifle here. I'm trying to think about what the best way to go about this is. I mean, I, I, I think it's just staying over there. It's just them ones come out of that corner right there so quick. God, 
God, do you... I don't even understand why, like, in zombies, why it even matters if there's a fire restriction on the weapon or not. I mean, like, why would they put a fire restriction on a weapon in zombies? Because it just, just slows you down. Especially when the weapon sucks anyways. It's got the damage of a two-month-year-old baby. See if we can save that for next round. If at all possible. Okay, I don't think that's gonna happen. You know, it's better to get it and use it. And it should last into next round. Okay, okay, reload, reload, pop him, and there's one more. Yes, there he is. Yes, round seven. Three more and we'll hit our goal, guys. Three more. Uh, and it goes away right at the beginning of the round. That's great. Whoa, why does keep kicking me off these steps? Better not do that here in a minute if I'm trying to run up. Let's just go ahead and buy some ammunition here. You know, I mean, we'll be fine as long as they keep spawning like more on this side because we can always run and, uh, oh yeah, sweep through over there like we're about one and a half to here. Okay. Use our some grenades here. Gotta reload this one right here and buy some more bullets. Two more rounds to go. Maybe if we get lucky, we'll get zombies on round nine if we survive this one. God, this gun sucks. Tiny so it's just like, I, I mean, I, I'd be fine. Like, I'd rather have them either all fast or all slow, but when you got like the little stragglers, they make problems. Ouch. Okay, 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 okay. Run, jump. Okay, he's gonna hit me. He's gonna hit me. Yep. Slap two times. Uh, well, possum pecker. Okay. Well, you know what? Like I said, I keep it honest. Got to round eight first try with the stay in spawn challenge. Just, you know, I highly suggest you try it yourself. See how far you can get. It's fun, despite the fact that it is hard. But uh, until the next zombie challenge video, which I'm probably going to make directly after I end this. Uh, adios.